Hello everyone, and here I'm with another Bonical review for Throwback Thursday, and today's event is on uh, Matorn Dakar and uh, Hydruga Morak from 2007. So, on the front of Dakar's booklet, which I'm, is the only entry in this one, but also, these are which first Matorn to have instruction manuals rather than a fold-out uh, slip. Well, only time they did that until with the Avatar in the following year, and yeah. See, Bonka logo, Dakar, and then set number 8930, and Lego logo, Choking Hazard, and picture of him running in action, shooting the Xamarosphere, and also Mari Nui in the background, and yeah. And then add for the Bonka Heroes game, since it's already been out, and also the website. Add for Shop at Home and Lego Club. Add for all the Brock key, which which these three will be next week's throwback or next next week's throwback Thursday, and all the pieces that come with the set, of course, in the last steps. So the first of which is Dakar himself. Well, quite a simpleish build for like any Matoran, but although. A little bit taller than most, is like as for the legs, of which simple Borok legs with the uh, Metru feet, and also there were a couple other or three other Matorns, like also sold separate Defalak, and also there was Sarja and Idris that came with Karzani, of course, but whereas they have which had some different things added to them. Like different types of and I can beat, of course. But also all of which had yeah. Had the Toa Hordika chest plate for a main body piece and and the arms of which are of course Toa Mata arms and his and Defalax were the normal uh blade pieces that they've introduced later on, used with other sets and have the Borok tooth piece as a back part. But Sarna and Idris had different kinds of ones, of course. And Def or Dekars here oh, was oh, which is Toa Norix and Tarakaduma's mask, but in yellow, oh, which nice for mocking. And of course Defalax was the was Toa Aruni's in uh, dark green. But also Idris's was Wenua's or Wenua Metru's the Riru, but in dark blue. So at least it was a time of recoloring and all. But if you look from the back, then both arms attached with a regular Viserac limb. And I see nothing in the back. None of that. Well, unless it was the two with the Karzani set, of course. But as for Defalak and Dakar here, which both have a Xamarosphere launcher, or this time around called the Solidified Air Bubble Launcher. Which you can hold down and like so. And of course, these, this time, the Xamarin spheres are being called the solidified air bubbles, of course. And I think that is it with him. And now on to the other one, Morak. So, as for both the Hydrukas, is built of a regular Technic beam that holds everything in place. But whereas Dulox, which had Kalma's armor piece and but Morax of which has Takadox's a uh, glow in the dark armor piece and also a single red spine or red spike of course. And also he does have the uh, translucent blue Viserac limbs from uh Anika Matoro of course. And the head simply just comprised of the like a dark metro head or dark or dark blue rock rocky head which carried from the Rahaga and the lower jaw just comprised of Nuperu and Nika's uh, claws. There's an see only two of, them, of which were in for that for that and see those have a couple of technique beams and of course one in red being the eye of course. And then the tail also provides provided of a Toa Mata arm and also solidified air bubble launcher above, of course. 
and the legs so which kind of small but not so much spaces since it's just metrumatorin limbs with uh, viscerac feet on them although i would suggest use the regular borak limbs like these ones make them a little longer and a little bit more possible of course and so now on to the final verdict for my overall verdict these of which uh pretty good uh, short small sets for 2000 early 2007 like good to like accompany the baraki until the toamari came around and also also have two different types of characters or different things and of course it was four of which rather than six but at least they were starting to branch off from cloning and whatnot and of course Dakar did have a key part in the storyline obviously since he was in the Baraki mini video and whatnot. And if you still have these sets from back then, well, I hope you had some good memories of them. And for those of you who haven't and still have access to these sets, then I'd say truly go ahead and get them. eBay Bricklink, whatever. And that's about it with this video. And thanks for watching and please subscribe.